Diwali Passport, brought to you by Chatak Food Products and Anan Brand Wax Deers. When it comes to Pira and Ladu, I just use Chatak's Ladu and Pira Mitai Mix. It's a combination of traditional ingredients in one pack. I don't spend all that time preparing different ingredients like ma. Three quarter of the work is done. So now I can make fresh, delicious Pira and Ladu in about 15 minutes with the convenience of Chatak's Ladu and Pira Mitai Mix. Now Ma's Kitchen is a Chata Kitchen. Now available, Gulab Jamun Instant Mitai Mix. Lighting up for Diwali just got simple with the easy-to-use Anand brand wax deers. They're scientifically engineered to last longer, burn brighter, and keep on lighting. Anand brand wax deers do not require any prepping or filling and has less spillage and cleanup. These deers are recommended for outdoor use and can withstand light wind and rain. Plus, they're eco-friendly. Redeem your use cases for cash back. So put some green innovation into your Diwali celebrations with with Anand Brand Wax Deers. The Festival of Lights glows once again in many nations. Let's take a trip and find the interesting variations. Some are quiet and simple, and others filled with family and friends. Join us now for Diwali Passport on WESN. Our passports are stamped and we're all set to fly away to another Diwali adventure. On this trip, we journey to the third most populous island in Oceania, New Zealand. New Zealand is an island country and one of the many islands that make up Oceania. It is located in the South Pacific Ocean to the southeast of Australia, south of New Caledonia, Fiji and Tonga Islands. Here, Hinduism is one of the fastest growing religions, with Hindus standing at 2.65% of the New Zealand population, which translates to approximately 120,000 people in a population of over 5 million. The first Hindu settlers in New Zealand were Sepoys, or Indian soldiers, in the 19th century. These settlers were from the regions of Punjab and Gujarat in India. Later, Hindu migrants came from other areas of India, as well as from Sri Lanka, Malaysia, South Africa and Australia. In New Zealand, Diwali is celebrated with great pomp and festivity among the Hindu, Jain and Sikh communities. The occasion is marked by the hosting of several festivals and events. One of the most attended events is the BNZ Auckland Diwali Festival. The BNZ Auckland Diwali Festival is a free, family-friendly event held annually and dubbed their Festival of Lights. The event is considered New Zealand's premier Indian cultural festival and it attracts over 60,000 attendees every year. This Diwali festival is held on the Saturday and Sunday before the actual Diwali observance. During the two-day festival, cultural performances are highlighted and stalls prepare and sell Indian delicacies and craft. Leading up to Diwali, a series of events are also hosted in various locations across New Zealand, including Christchurch and Auckland. These events feature Indian food vendors, music and cultural activities. In the evening, the attendees are also treated to incredible fireworks displays. In New Zealand, Diwali is observed over a five-day period, just like in other regions, and different activities are performed on each day. On the first day, Diwali is known as Dhantiras. Devotees clean and decorate their homes, engage in the worship of Mother Lakshmi, the goddess of light and prosperity. Lord Dhanvantari, the deity presiding over Ayurveda, is also honored. The purchase of precious metals, stones and new garments are encouraged on this day. The second day is Narak Chaturdashi or Choti Diwali, small Diwali. On this day, Lord Krishna is honored for his victory over the demon Narakasur, thus setting the world free from all dread. During Narak Chaturdashi, it is prescribed that devotees massage their bodies with oil, bathe the body and rest to prepare for the following big day of Diwali celebrations. The third day of Diwali is the festival's main day. Houses are decorated, diyas are lit, mitai or sweets and food prepared as families come together for puja. On this day, devotees worship Lord Ganesh and Mother Lakshmi. 
They revere Lakshmi as a symbol of wealth and success. The occasion also marks Lord Ram's triumph over the wicked king, Rawan, and his return to his kingdom, Ayodhya. Thus, firecrackers are set off, deers are lit, and sweets are treated as signals of celebration. The fourth day of Diwali is Govardhan Puja Day. As New Zealand has a heavy Gujarati presence, this day is celebrated with grand festivities at the Sri Swaminarayan Mandir in Auckland. During the worship, Lord Krishna is praised for his heroic act of lifting the Govardhan Hill and providing refuge to residents during torrential downpours. During the observance, devotees offer a mountain of food, metaphorically representing the Govardhan Hill. The fifth and final day of Diwali is called Bhai Dooj. On this day, brothers customarily visit their sisters. Sisters tie a sacred thread to the wrist of brothers and feed them sweets. In return, brothers offer gifts to sisters as a sign of their love. And with this festival, Diwali in New Zealand comes to an end. Thank you for coming along with us on our Diwali trip to New Zealand. I'm Shamji. Join us again for another adventure soon here on WESN's Diwali Passport. Lighting up for Diwali just got simple with the easy-to-use Anand brand wax deers. They're scientifically engineered to last longer, burn brighter, and keep on lighting. Anand brand wax deers do not require any prepping or filling and has less spillage and cleanup. These deers are recommended for outdoor use and can withstand light wind and rain. Plus, they're eco-friendly. Redeem your use cases for cash back. So put some green innovation into your Diwali celebrations with Anand brand wax deals. When it comes to Pira and Ladu, I just use Chatak's Ladu and Pira Mitai Mix. It's a combination of traditional ingredients in one pack. I don't spend all that time preparing different ingredients like Ma. Three quarter of the work is done. So now I can make fresh, delicious Pira and Ladu in about 15 minutes with the convenience of Chatak's Ladu and Pira Mitai Mix. Now Ma's kitchen is a Chatak kitchen. Now available, Gulab Jamun Instant Mitai Mix. Diwali Passport, brought to you by Chatak Food Products and Anand brand Wax Deers.